All right, guys, today we're gonna look at the Exotic Effects AC Booster. Um, I reviewed the BB Preamp before, which is a similar type pedal, it's just more gain, a little different voicing. Also by Exotic, really cool pedal. So this is the sort of uh, in-between of the three pedals, this and the RC Booster. So uh, it is a booster pedal, not really an overdrive, but you can't get overdrive out of it, or distortion, really, if you crank the gain high enough. Uh, important things. Uh, this probably looks like uh, an old AC booster, and that's because it is. No, I'm kidding. In, in all seriousness, this is an old AC booster, and uh, the insides have been modified so that it is a new AC booster, the newest uh, version, but it looks like the old one because it's an old one's case. Anyway, so uh, today we're playing through the Mark IV with the PRS uh, CE22. As you can see, uh, the AC booster is being powered by the T-Rex Rubber Ducky here. I'm sorry, a Voodoo Lab Rubber Ducky, apparently. And uh, so that's how we're powering the pedal. And uh, I'll be uh, I'll be stepping on it with the uh, the T-Rex shoe. So important tonal stuff. Anyway, so here's the clean tone. Okay, so now if we step on the AC booster here, uh, you can see that the light is on, and that means it's on. And uh, I've got the volume set pretty close to unity gain, so it sounds like this. All right, that's with the gain all the way down and the volume uh, pretty much at unity. Uh, and, and the treble and bass in their middle positions, so they are neither boosting or cutting. Um, so, yeah, let me just play a little like that on the bridge and uh, both pickups and then also the neck pickup. So here's the bridge pickup. Here's the uh, both pickups together. And the neck pickup. It's a cool sound. Um, so now let's uh, we'll bring the gain up a little bit. I'm gonna leave the volume where it is so it may increase in volume a little bit. Let's bring the gain up to about nine o'clock. And uh, back to the bridge pickup sounds like this. And 
then finally just crank it all the way up. Switch it back off here for a second. Put the gain back down to zero, and we're gonna go over to a uh, crunchy sound on the amp. So that sounds like this by itself. Uh, it's moderately crunchy, and so now let's uh, let's just kick on the AC in front of it uh, without any gain or anything. Let's just see what that does to the tone. So to my ears, that just warms and compresses it a little bit like that. So um, let's take the gain up to about, uh, let's say about 10 o'clock this time. Here's without. Yank it up to about three, see what that does. So on the neck pickup, we're basically in, in fuzz pedal territory when you're over top of a gain sound. So um, let's take that back down a little bit, say maybe about 9 o'clock, and uh, let's give it a level boost. See what that does, so we'll pull that up to about there. So by itself. That's a little cleaner. Now let's mess with the EQ a little bit. So let's put the volume back to about here, gain about 10:30, and uh, let's um, add some treble. So that might be a little drastic, but just, just so you can hear. So. Really makes that upper harmonic pop out. Let's give it some more. All right, let's take this back to Unity, let's add some bass. It's got a lot of bass on tap, but if you have too much bass, you can take some out like this. Or maybe 
you have too much treble, you can warm it up like this. Pretty heavy gain saturation. So here's the, uh, the amp by itself. And uh, maybe I want to use a lead tone from this pedal, but uh, I want to change the character a little bit. So here's what I can do I can uh, turn the volume back a little bit, add some bass, some treble, let's put the treble by Unity, and uh, let's see what that does. So here's the amp by itself. So I think I'm a little warmer than that. So let's take some treble out, add some bass, add just a little bit of volume back, and see what this does. it up a lot. Let's try um, taking this back some more, adding a little more bass, some more volume, let's take the game back, let's get something a little, a little cleaner and, and more Eric Johnson-y. Finally, let's just uh, crank this volume all the way up, take this back a little bit, add a little bit more gain, some treble, and let's just get kind of a cool uh, screaming sound. So, again, amp by itself. So that's the AC Booster by Exotic Effects. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comment section below, and I will catch you next time.